Oh, straight fire. That first rep, fire. <laughs> All right, hi everybody, John Meadows here with two special guests. You kept harassing me. Train with Evan, train with Evan. I listen to fine, you. Fine, fine, Evan's here. <laughs> Evan's here. <laughs> this is my man Corey too. I'm Corey, just here to follow along. Corey runs ANC Nutrition Center in Avon, Connecticut. We have an event tomorrow. So Evan is gonna put us through a leg workout. So let's get to work. Let's do it. All right. All right, we're gonna go back to this here in about 45 minutes. I want you to look on my side. <laughs> What's this say here? You see that? You see that? <laughs> you probably weren't a video game guy, were you? Mortal Kombat, of course. Dude, I was a Mortal Kombat. Did you see my side? Did you see me? Yeah. <laughs> I was doing a seminar in San Diego and this guy works for this sock company and I now have like Aquaman socks, Spider-Man, Captain America, <laughs> sports, he's just into these. They're really cool. He's a really good kid. Did really you send good. him uh, what you want or does he just make them? He, he watches my social media, media so he knows what I like. Oh, yeah, yeah. And he saw me talking about Mortal Kombat and next thing you know those were in the mail. <laughs> I was like, that's a badass picture. Yeah. How cool would that be? We sitting here, oh that's me. <laughs> yeah, me too. Oh, you know what it might be too? You're a little short, it might have to move us. It might help. You know what else might help? Lots of great. If I got strong. Well, it doesn't really matter if they're strong or not because they look good. They look great. They're still pretty separated, aren't they? Uh, yeah, a little bit. Yeah. Damn that burn. The warm up. Good extension, right? Yeah, I like it. Smooth. I, I don't know about you, but I don't feel a lot of pressure on my knees with this extension. It's a, it's a, a misnomer that leg extensions destroy your knees. When you actually understand the horizontal force and the way it works, uh -huh. it might not feel real comfortable to some people, but just to generally say these tear your knees up is not comfortable. Oh, yeah, I don't think so. Uh, They take what? My supplements. I have the... Uh, Every time I bring my Arc Reactor or my pre Premium or my Recovery, they take it. I have the... Uh, and I don't check bags. I always carry my bags with me. So. I always like to keep my knees tight in against, against that.
six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, five. nine, and twenty. Lesson number one, I can't use as much weight as that one, so I'm going to have to get some lighter dumbbells. That's lesson number one. Ego is got to get... Dude, I literally have like a big bump on my legs already. <laughs> That's it. Come on. Come on. Seven. Uh, Come on. Eight. Uh, two more, two more. Up, one more. Uh, Push. Oh, uh, shit. Good. Ten, baby. I just put this uh, workout online okay. a few days ago. People were like, do you really think that's enough? It was like this. It was like a few sets of this super set. I think it was like maybe three sets of barbell squat and then hacks. What you people were like, is that really enough? It's, it's like, well, you, if you fucking do it hard enough, it's enough. <laughs> it's what you put into it. If you're going to do the most, you do it like a little bitch, then no. <laughs> I feel like a lot of people don't understand the difference between warm-up sets and working sets, too. I think most people don't understand the difference between working out and training. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I get people all the time, like, do three sets, or like, three sets. But, like, when do I get to my top weight? I'm like, no, get no. to your weight. Then, then you do, do three, three sets. sets. Right. 
how, how many reps do I do? As many as you fucking can. Put it back. Okay, I got it. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Oof. Ah, one, two, three, four, five, mm. one, five six, seven, mm. eight. Nine uh, and ten. Uh, One, two, three. Uh, come on. Come on, halfway. Seven, eight, uh, nine, and uh, ten. Oh, yeah. Alright, I'm try to go almost all the way to the bottom. Okay, I can do that. What do you think, Try <clears throat> That's it. Ow. Ow. down. That's it. Ah. Come on, three more, three more. One. I got you, come on. Let's go. Oh. Two. Yes, one more. Oh. Nice. Oh. I'll try it. Hold up. I'll try it. Hold up. 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 months ago where if I pulled that pin out and I attempted to do just just the weight of the apparatus with yeah. my left leg yeah. oh, dude, the pain and it was shit oh. but I finally got to the point now where it's a lot stronger but now dude as soon as I do it this leg fucking hurts you know so when I go to press I feel it so for me even though maybe it's not the greatest mass building movement it was vital for me to like just neurologically yeah. 
turn the muscle on so that when I would go to press, it would actually be productive. Right. That makes sense to me, man. What's that? It makes sense to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then when we do our pressing stuff, then that shit's really gonna feel good. Yeah, and you know, you don't feel it in your <laughs> knees. We'll be in our joints. We'll be all right in muscle. Activated and exhausted. <laughs> Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, five, ten. Same tempo, the whole way. I, I used to train with fire loads. And, uh, That's like what you're explosive. Yeah, yeah. Every, like, everything I do. Everything is explosive. Half the time it's not because I need to train to. Right, it's just, it's just what program. Right. The only thing that feels like when I do something like this, I don't. The most exercises I do is... Go ahead, come on. Five, six, don't stop. Seven, eight, up, keep going. Three more, all the way up, one, two, one more, John. Nice. Nice, sir. Whole foot, four. Seven. Uh, nice, 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 nice. Grip. This way, okay. The most important thing: put your hands out, rest them on here, okay. okay. And almost pick up on your shoulders a little bit, okay. And keep your back stay totally straight, straight. And you'll be able to, to sink all the way down, all keeping your back straight. Yep. I got you. So for me, I keep my feet about here. Control. Perfect control. Whoa. Perfect control. Yeah. Nice. Pick up 
up on your shoulders, pick up on your chest. Sink deep. That's it. Whole feet. Heel to toe, everything. All the way down. Yes, right back down. No lockout, right back down. No lockout, right down. That's it, come on. One more, right back, come on. Push, yes. Nice. That is not light. That is not light. Back to work. Tuck jump, I can get my feet up to the bar where I would squat from, so wow. my feet come about right there. Yeah. That's why this like this explosion is so natural for my body, man. That's why like it's harder to slow it down. It's really hard. It's this one be good though. It's not what you naturally want to do. This one be good. This one I have a super slow motion. Most people you would bury that squat. Yeah, this one's made to Hams go. Deep. to your fucking cat. There you go. That's what I was just gonna say, you know. This one's made good. Eat. A lot of people say they do a barbell squat. They're not gonna, they're gonna have a hard time doing that kind of squat. So if you use a machine like this, you might as well get that kind of get the range, right? range out of it. I just did a video on quad weight, but I told people it's like no magic exercise. It's fully lengthening. Like when you go deep like that, that's fast for flat hours, man. Like that, that kind of a range of motion all the way down. Let me in here, let me in here, man. I can't wait to get in that thing. I love this thing. Okay, I gotta remember how to do it though. Just push it up. This, this will... It's a little tight on your neck. 
need to do a set to you, so. <laughs> you know what's crazy? What's that? Is that feels super slow for me. Really? That <laughs> feels like I'm in slow motion. That's how fucked up my nervous system is. <laughs> what do you like so far, though, John? I, you know what, man? I actually love the spider bar more than any bar. But if it's just a straight, regular bar, though, what do you like? You're in Ohio. Use Rogue or you like Texas? Probably the Texas ones. That's my favorite. Yeah. That's I, I don't think you could beat a Texas motor. Yeah, that's favorite. Those things are pretty badass. I think that's the fucking best bar on these trucks. Especially for the market. I don't I don't think you'll find a better bar on the market. I don't market. have to worry about it rolling down, shit puts all in We used to test the safety of bars at days. We'd load it up with four or five hundred pounds. And we just dump it. We just throw it off ourselves. Oh, see if it bend or to see if it would shatter or bend. Like when you get the elite FTS stuff. Yeah. It's testing. You're getting the heavy duty stuff. All right, here we go. Let's go. Uh. 
roll. That's it, John. So I think we're going on quads. You want to do any more? Good. Quads, no. Good. We'll do some cats? All right. Yeah, I'll do some cats. Well, we got all this equipment, so we didn't just line a bunch of stuff up. So like four movements back to back? Yeah, four movements back to back. All right. Super pump. All right. All right, all right let's do it. Cats. Medium weight. You guys notice this machine lends itself to really getting up on your toes. Good contraction. Whereas this one here, let's hit this one, and then we'll hit that one. These two really lend themselves to the stretch, particularly the one down there, but. I like these because you can really stretch. Get a monster stretch on this. Great contraction. <sighs> All the way up on the toes. Six eight left. There we go. There we go. Good. There we go. Up here with some more stretching. First set he did, that was a lot of reps with a heavy weight.
six. Come on, all the way up. Up and then up again. Up. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> up and then up again. Up and up. Up and up. Just stretched it. You missed it. A big lump went in there. <laughs> it's okay now. Yeah. 
All right, guys, gals, thanks for watching. I know I said legs, but we did quads and calves. Um, thank you very much. That was very painful. Literally after the first warm-up set of 30, <laughs> I was in pain, man. That was, that was enough. Did that feel good? It felt good. All right, so I just want to thank Evan. Thank you very much. Thank you. Always a pleasure, dude. Always. Thank you. Great to be here. Thanks, Corey, man. Appreciate you coming Appreciate down. Appreciate it. Man. Appreciate you guys watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Let us know what you think in the comments below, and we'll see you next time. All right, so we just finished up training legs. Evan had to get home. So Corey and I are going to chow down. He's brought me to this place. What's this place called? It's just Exit 8 Diner. The Exit 8 Diner. I have no idea what they serve in here. I have no clue. So good diner food. But whatever they have in here, hopefully it's good. <laughs> so there we go. So I got a hero. I haven't had one of these in a long time. And I just couldn't pass it up. I actually passed it up to pancakes, but Corey saved me and he got some pancakes. I couldn't I couldn't, you know, let you not even see yeah, it. I know. I changed as soon as I saw that I changed my mind. <laughs> and sweet potato fries. So we're both very hungry. Need that refuel. Pancakes down from him. Hero. Is it a hero or a gyro? How would you say it? Gyro. Gyro. Okay. And why why am I calling it a hero? I don't know. Gyro maybe? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Comment below. Is it a hero or a gyro? <laughs> <laughs>